All right, hey ladies and gentlemen, I am uh, with my family here and uh, we're heading up to the mountains for a few days, uh, but we figured on the way up we would stop for some lunch and uh, kind of near where we're eating, there's a Goodwill. So I'm gonna go inside and see if we can find any profits, maybe help pay for some of this vacation. So let's go.
right, so super quick trip, but $50.64 spent, saved $12.68, and uh, just those two rackets are gonna be 80 bucks, so all the clothing is extra. Should be able to head down right here. It's a little steep though. Yeah. Watch your step. Don't want to go tumbling down. No. Squirrel. Squirrel. Yeah. Nice. Squirrel. 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 Oh, I see it now. Hey, Mom, squirrel. Yeah, squirrel. You hear him over there chirping? Squirrel! Coming at us. They feed them up here. That's where they're coming up. <laughs> oh. Go see him. You want to go see him, honey? That's my idea of fishing. Do you want to go see it? I got some great pictures of these. <laughs> stole an apple and run off. You got dog food, apple, and uh, bagel for this. Nice. Okay, let's head straight down. You have to be very careful where you're walking. Do you want me to go first? Yeah, go ahead. Go first. You got it. Oh, careful, kid. Ow. You all right? Scraped up your shin. Alright, we'll come over here because there's a guy fishing right there. There's a ton of little baby fish right there.
cat had and it's right here. It's a little dirty. But I looked it up. What is this Toki Doki Marvel? Three forty nine. And those are selling for forty five bucks. Ladies and gentlemen, so I've uh, taken a little break here in the video just to say uh, one thank you for uh, joining to this point and I uh, appreciate you checking out the video. Uh, hopefully, like I said, it made sense in the beginning of the video. We were going on vacation. I decided while we were on vacation that there was two different spots we were at that was going to be Goodwills. And I said, hey, wouldn't it be kind of cool if we could pay for this trip or a whole bunch of this trip uh, by hitting the thrift store for like 30 minutes each time. So I spent about 20 minutes at the first one and I spent about 15, 20 minutes at the second one. Uh, and I was able to come out with some pretty good numbers. And uh, I'll go over those at the end here. Uh, because I want to show you the camera stuff. Uh, I didn't get footage of that and I've already sold some of the things that I bought there so I'm just gonna have to show you on the computer. Uh, there was three things that I bought and uh, let's see if we can move myself on this screen to be a little bit better. So anyways uh, this one right here I paid uh, $9.99 uh, for this one uh, it was in that case there, and it sold for $59.99. It's free shipping, so it made a little bit less than that, uh, but still a solid profit that we got there. Uh, I sold this GPS unit. Uh, this one, it was $39.99, but I got the 20% off. Hopefully you know all those prices. I always get 20% off at Goodwill if you spend 20 bucks or more. Uh, so this GPS unit, it was new in the box. It included some bonus maps and things like that. And uh, hopefully you can see there, $214.99. And this is a sold. So this one physically sold already and buyer paid uh, shipping. So that one was pretty awesome. Uh, I'll see you go through some of the pictures. You can see it working there. I showed that it was working, that it had the maps. You can see all the cables are still sealed, uh, et cetera, et cetera. And then the last thing that I bought in there uh, was this Nishika. Nishika. I'm not sure how you pronounce that. If you know how to pronounce that, uh, did I get it right? Let me know down in the comments. Uh, anyways, the comps on this thing are crazy. Uh, so I listed mine at $199.99, uh, or best offer, and just waiting to kind of see uh, what happens there. It is a quad lens, so you can see above my head there, there are four different camera lenses. I probably should dust that off and take some better pictures. Um, but anyways, it's a 3D camera and uh, pretty rare. And uh, so I said, I'm just gonna list it on the high end and see what happens. Uh, you can see it's got 482 views up there, so pretty popular uh, item. And uh, hopefully that will end up turning into big sale. Uh, so anyways, uh, let's just talk about some of the numbers uh, real quick on here. So uh, I we booked a cabin uh, on VRBO uh, to stay out up in Heber. The cabin cost us $724.27. So that was the biggest chunk of our stay. Obviously, we spent, you know, probably another 500 bucks in food and stuff while we were gone. Um, but the big chunk was the 724.27, and my thought was, hey, can we cover the cabin? And uh, what we did uh, was we spent $50.64 at the first one. 
uh, with a potential profit or a potential sales of $292.94, potential profit on that first one of just over $207. Bucks. Uh, on the second stop, we spent $100.80. Uh, we listed $399.96. Uh, that's still listed right now. We have already sold uh, $399.53 out of that one, and we sold $63 out of the first one. So total spent $151.44. Uh, total potential, if everything sells, one thousand ninety-two forty-three. Uh, actual already sold is four sixty-two fifty-three. So I'm way into the profit already, anyways. Uh, and potential profit, assuming everything sells at within a few percentage points, uh, eight oh nine. 89. So uh, two days where we were at, we were there for four days, um, well the day plus three nights. Uh, anyways, uh, spending 30 minutes on the way up and spending 30 minutes on one of the days when it was kind of storming and we couldn't do anything outside anyways, uh, we were able to basically, or should be able to by the time a few more things sell, pay for the entire rental. Uh, and some of that becomes tax deductible at this point because now this was a business trip because I sourced while I was up there. You also get to write off the mileage and all that fun stuff. Consult your CPA to verify what you can and can't do there. Uh, but again, I feel pretty uh, happy with that. And uh, again, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video to this point. If you have enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Uh, if you're not subscribed to the channel, please consider subscribing to the channel and uh, leave a comment. It makes a big deal to me uh, for the video to be potentially shown to more people. And uh, YouTube likes to do that based off of likes and comments. So uh, anyways, like and comment if you can. And if you're interested in getting a little mini tour of the place that we stayed, uh, stay tuned after this. We're we're gonna jump right into a little mini tour of the cabin that we stayed at just for fun so anyways uh, thanks for watching stay tuned it's not cooperating with me it won't let me that big old worm you just pinch it. Pinch it in half. Pinch and pull. Not working. <laughs>